Welcome back to Paper Highlighter. Today, we dive into the latest buzz surrounding 90 Day Fiancé. Happily Ever After, star Jasmine Pineda. Did she secure the coveted title in the beauty pageant of season 8? Alum Jasmine Pineda aspired to clinch the pageant crown in season 8, with Gino Palazzolo diligently managing her. Previously a teacher in Panama City specializing in American literature, Jasmine shifted gears after losing her job, turning to adult content creation to support herself. Eventually moving to the U.S. to marry Gino, Jasmine initially aimed for a real estate career before unexpectedly pivoting to pursue her dream through a beauty competition. Despite it being her debut as a contestant, Jasmine rebuffed constructive feedback from Gino, who funded her entry. She labeled him a pervert for showing videos of other more successful women during rehearsals. Jasmine's determination to prove Gino wrong by winning the pageant contrasts with his sole desire for her to secure the crown, despite Despite lacking prior pageant experience, Jasmine remains dedicated, leaving fans curious about her potential to emerge victorious. Does Jasmine have a modeling background? During her time on the show, Jasmine remained tight-lipped about her educational background. However, in February 2023, she surprised fans by revealing herself as Dr. Jasmine Pineda, holding a doctoral degree in education and research. Jasmine disclosed her impressive academic journey, boasting seven degrees accumulated over the years. These include a Bachelor of Arts in Literature, three master's degrees, a postgraduate degree, and a technical certification. Complemented by numerous seminars and courses in various educational fields, Gino's admiration for Jasmine stemmed from her blend of intellect and beauty. Jasmine applied her intelligence by pursuing a career as a teacher, specializing in American literature while also working as a private tutor. Unfortunately, her teaching career came to an abrupt end when Gino, in a misguided attempt to incite jealousy, forwarded topless photos of Jasmine to an ex-partner, leading to her dismissal. That information was spread among schools, and I was like banned from teaching, she said before adding, he ruined my career. Jasmine turned to adult modeling as a means of income, attracting subscribers to her OnlyFans page with provocative photos shared on social media. She intensified her focus on maintaining a healthy diet and regular gym sessions. Ultimately, her dedication bore fruit as she earned the opportunity to represent Panama in the beauty pageant. Why did Jasmine participate in the beauty pageant? Jasmine's aspiration to become a beauty pageant queen began when she flew to Miami to celebrate her 38th birthday and reunited with her friend from Panama, Leandro. Feeling emotionally neglected by Gino and grappling with her mother's recent cancer diagnosis, Jasmine also faced uncertainty about when her sons would join her in America, which contributed to her experiencing severe alopecia. Concerned for her well-being, Leandro introduced Jasmine to a friend who organized beauty pageant workshops. Attending a workshop for Ms. International World proved transformative for Jasmine, offering her a renewed sense of purpose. Jasmine attended the workshop hosted by Willina, a former Ms. International World winner recommended by Leandro. There, she met fellow beauty Queens and Angela Facilico, the pageant director. Jasmine candidly expressed concerns about her age and alopecia, fearing she might appear too mature. Her peers reassured her that age was irrelevant in pageantry and encouraged her not to dwell on her alopecia, pointing out that many contestants used wigs and clip-ins. They empowered Jasmine to embrace her reflection and cultivate self-love. Jasmine wasn't performing well in the competition. Gino initially withheld support for Jasmine's dreams, delaying payment of the participation fees until she pleaded with him. Upon paying, he expressed a desire to manage Jasmine, citing his near-miss experience in Mr. Michigan. He attempted to coach her, pointing out flaws in her posture and using videos of other contestants as examples. Jasmine grew upset with Gino's critique of her runway walk, accusing him of lacking positive reinforcement. She eventually uninvited him from accompanying her to rehearsals. Jasmine wasn't the winner in 2023. According to the Instagram page for Ms. International World, the event was held in October 2023 at Port St. Lucie, Florida, featuring 22 contestants from diverse countries including India, Ukraine, and Uruguay. Tarachi Garnier emerged victorious as Ms. International World, while Jasmine's outcome in the competition on 90 Day Fiancé, Happily Ever After, remains un 
undisclosed, the Panamanian beauty recently shared behind-the-scenes photos from the pageant. She expressed gratitude to the organizers, describing her experience as part of an incredible sisterhood. This event marks a potential beginning for Jasmine in the world of pageantry.